Hello everyone, it is Simtastic for Real here and I'm back with another part of the Chen's Let's Play. We are at part number 22 and it is the season finale in this part. Uh, so I think what we will do is wrap up the kids being teenagers and they'll be going off to college. So, uh, so we will be back with a, a season two uh, and it will be their life in college. So it will be Charlotte and Landon and Malcolm, Lydia, Olivia, everyone will be going to college. So it is a Saturday in the game and so what I thought we could do is maybe uh, go to the park or something and shoot some hoops, maybe go hang out at the teen hangout, uh, get ready for basically just get ready for college in this episode. I want uh, Landon and Lydia and Malcolm and Charlotte to all apply for scholarships uh, as well as Olivia. So we may have Malcolm and everything come over and they can just um, apply for them at our house. So we're just going to go ahead and jump in the game here. And let's see. Okay, what is everyone doing? I think Landon and Malcolm just got back from the park. They were there uh, shooting some hoops. And uh, Landon is talking with Charlotte. I know he and Olivia have kind of a secret relationship, um, so we'll see if that comes out in this part with Charlotte. Hopefully, hopefully everything gets wrapped up in this part. If not, maybe the secret can go with them to college, because um, I think Charlotte would be talking with Olivia a lot about college and being like, listen, I really want to go to Brightchester. I want to go with my sister, because Lydia would also be going to Brightchester. Um, and then Landon and Malcolm will go to Foxbury, I think. So, uh, yeah. So we'll have Lydia, since she's already on the computer, let's have her apply for scholarships. Okay. Apply for scholarship. Uh, Newcrest resident. And then how is her... Because I saw that she could apply for a... Um, she doesn't have athletic. What is... What did it say she could apply for? Uh, athletics, but she doesn't really have athletic skill. That's weird. Okay. <laughs> uh, all right. And then I want Landon to also apply for scholarship. Uh, let's see. And then Malcolm can also apply. And then I think Malcolm will stay overnight tonight again. Um, we can just replace this because that's really annoying. Uh, and I think he'll stay overnight tonight because it is, um, they'll be going off to college pretty soon. So I think he'd be staying over, um, and hanging out with Landon because they're going to be, they're actually going to be roommates. So, all right. So Landon has a lot he can apply for. Okay. So he can apply for athletics. I just think he should just apply for everything. Well, maybe not the, um, because athletic, he'll have to be part of the soccer team. Um, so that's at like 6 p.m. every single night except for Sunday. So he can't, oh, okay. So he can't do esports if he does athletics. But I think he would apply for athletics. Uh, and then I want him to apply for music and apply for the last one, which is Newcrest Resident, I think. All right, and then I think we'll have their birthday at the end of this part, him and Lydia's, and then we'll just age up Malcolm, um, too. And little EJ, oh my gosh, he's so excited. He's like, everyone, everyone, I pooped. <laughs> okay, so maybe she'll ask him to go potty because he probably has to go. That's probably what he's saying. Okay, so she, so he applied for everything, and then I want Charlotte to get on the computer, and I want her to apply for her scholarships as well. And I think I want to change her aspiration too, because I want it to be something different. Um, all right, can you, university, apply for scholarships? All right, so I think Charlotte will apply for Newcrest resident, and then, oh, and then I want her to apply for another. All right, and then I think Charlotte would also apply for athletics. Um, I don't know if she'll get it, because uh, athletics, she doesn't even have that skill. Like, what? 
I thought they had to have the skill in order to apply. It's so weird. Anyways, um, okay, and then it's Malcolm's turn. So I want him to apply. Um, he's doing his homework, his high school homework, but that's okay, buddy, because um, next time we see you, you'll be in college. Oh, Charlotte. Oh, no, she's angry from who? Who is she hurt by? Him? Yep. Oh my gosh. Landon. All right, come over and sit on the couch, Landon, and apologize to your sister, please. All right, and then I want him to apply for scholarships. All right, so I think Malcolm will apply for a Newcrest resident, and then I kind of want him to go into the robotics career, and I think that's part of the, well, I don't know if that's part of the esports. Um, but how is his video gaming skill? Uh, it's decent. Um, maybe I'll have him be like an esports guy. Scholarship, apply for scholarship. Foxbury Institute. Okay. Oh, he's researching. That's what I hit. That's not what I meant to hit. Okay. Should he be athletic or esports? Well, I kind of want them all to kind of do different things. So I want Charlotte to be in athletics, Landon to be in athletics. Lydia, she's not really doing either of those activities. Um, I know that eSports kind of gets you kind of late activity to main this scholarship. Sim must be enrolled in university and participate in the eSports after school activity to main this scholarship. Um, yeah, just do eSports, buddy. And then I can, maybe I can change it. I don't know, probably not, but. All right, and then grandma is in taking a nap. Okay, and I want, Lydia is gonna also take a nap because she has to go to work tonight. And she's probably gonna quit her job. Well, I don't know, she might still do babysitting while she's at college. I don't know if she can. Um, but yeah, you guys, this is just kind of like a, a we're not ending the Chens, we're just gonna be doing a season two. So this is just the ending of season one. Um, but they will be back. They're just going to be going to college and doing their college life. So they're all really excited to be heading off to college soon. Charlotte's eating her protein plate. <laughs> all right. And then I think what I'll do is I'm going to have Landon just do a sneaky text to Olivia and just like send a happy text and maybe she'll invite us out somewhere. Oh my gosh, Aaron. I think what I might do is I might age up all of the other teens that are in the neighborhood, so including Aaron, and I'll probably just place them. Um, I don't know if I'll play them in order to enroll them in university, but I really want them to kind of like hang out at university. I agree, Landon, it's a great day. Let's go out and enjoy the day. All right, let's go to the park. All right, you guys, so we have made it to the park and I think Landon's gonna be like, hey, Olivia, would you mind um, coming over with me and shooting uh, shooting around a little bit just so that I can um, really look good for the, the college scouts? And we're right by her house too. Her house is right there. Where is she? Okay. And I think she'd be like, yeah, Landon, sure, I'll help you. So she's gonna come over and help him shoot around, shoot around together. And then, uh, yeah, so she's going to help him try out for the team at college. Hopefully he can make it. I think he, does he even have an athletic? Why doesn't anybody have athletic on their thing, but then they have it? And I, I've been having him like shoot around and stuff. And he's been going jogging and stuff and taking EJ for jogs and stuff. So I don't know what's going on. Um... Oh my god, I just love this park. It's so pretty. It's going to be so sad leaving this town. The kids have grown up here. Um, this was their first town that they came to after uh, their parents passed away. Oh, and there is uh, Ruby Adams. That is Malcolm's girlfriend's dog. <laughs> Family dog. Uh, and then there's like all kinds of dogs here running around. That's so cute. Uh, I did have to change it. I feel like such an idiot, but like I had to change it because I put it as national park and then like no one was showing up. And so 
I put it, I switched it to park and now everyone's showing up. So that's a, that's a good tip. So like if you, um, if you're at a community lot and like no one's showing up, it's usually probably whatever you've set it to, which I'm kind of surprised that like national park means no one shows up, but it's okay. And there's like all kinds of little doggies here. So Rosie, oh my goodness. Oh, and then she's from college. She's from university. That's insane. All right. All right. So they're shooting around. Excited. Maybe we can challenge her to a game. Challenge to a hoops competition. Let's see this interaction. Because I think when Charlotte did it, it didn't really do anything. Oh, he's like so excited. He's like in the zone. Making three shots in a row is pretty good. Landon, oh, <laughs> Landon learns pretty fast, I think it said, or something like that. Oh, and then there is Malcolm's girlfriend's mom. One of them. All right. Oh, what are you doing? Get out of here, Sophia. I shouldn't say that. That's so mean. And then, um, can he give her just a kiss on the cheek? Kiss neck. I don't want to be like that. Can you just give her like a quick kiss on the cheek? Um, okay. You can embrace her and then hold her hand. Oh, kiss cheek. Okay. Aww. They are just so cute together. I mean, like I said, I really liked Aaron and him together, but Olivia is just so cute with him. And oh, they're cold. Oh no, she's cold. Okay, here I'm gonna um, ha invite her over uh, for the afternoon, well, the evening, and then um, I think I blow her a kiss, and then uh, I'll just invite her over, um, and then we will meet you back at the Chen's. All right, you guys, so we are back at the Chen's and uh, Landon and Olivia just arrived. Olivia's gonna apply for scholarships here at the Chen's um, cause she's just hanging out. And then I want Malcolm to keep his homework. All right, so she's gonna apply for scholarships and then um, Grandma Chen is over there. Oh, workplace scholars. Sims who have shown success in a career can apply for career for scholarship, not available for adult or elder Sims. Okay, um, and then that's a new one. I've never seen that. That's awesome. Okay, because I guess she is part of the um, manual labor career. Newcrest resident. Yep. All right, and then I'm going to have her eat some of Grandma Piper's yummy food so she can just have something to eat while she's here. And then... Malcolm, like I said, he'll be spending the night, but he looks like he's not tired. Oh, and Lydia is at work. Charlotte is sleeping. And then I think Landon is just going to keep, um, still keep it on the hush-hush with Olivia for a little bit. Um, because Grandma Piper's right here, so, and she would definitely tell Charlotte. <laughs> Cause just grandma's like that. She's like, I, I will, I will tell her because she's my baby. Just like you're my baby. <laughs> All right. And then I think grandma Piper will probably take little EJ for a night walk. It is really late, but that's okay. She's like carrying him around. She won't let him down. All right. Can you, <laughs> all right. So she's putting him down. Everyone's gathered here. It's really awkward. Okay. Can you just go on a short walk with EJ, please? All right, and then uh, Malcolm, can you repair this for Grandma Piper, please? And Olivia and him are chatting, that's so cute, okay. Um, no, don't flirt, uh, ask about day. She's probably like, I just wanna get to know Landon's best friend, even though they really, they know each other a lot, I mean, they're, they're uh, great friends, so. Are they even better friends than Landon and him are? No, okay. <laughs> All right, and then 
um, mess around in the shower. Oh my gosh. Okay. Keep it PG, folks. Keep it PG. All right, you guys. So we are here at the coffee shop, the infamous coffee shop. Um, and Malcolm actually in, called up Tara. This is Tara, his girlfriend. And he's like, hey, do you want to come out um, and hang out with me? And she was like a little bit reluctant at first and kind of snippy on the phone with him. And, um, but then she ended up, oh, then she ended up coming out with him. Uh, so they're just going to be talking a little bit. And this lady's listening in, which is weird, but uh, whatever. <laughs> and then I think uh, Tara's just going to be like, listen, Malcolm, I haven't even really seen you very much. You hang out with Charlotte all the time and you hang out with the Chens, but especially Charlotte. I see you guys at school together all the time and you never give me the time of day. And he's just gonna be like, listen, they're my friends. They're people that I grew up with. Um, I love them dearly and you don't really have anything to worry about. They're just, they're just really close friends of mine. And she's gonna be like, that's not what I'm worried about. I'm just worried that you're always spending time with them and you never give me any attention. And um, it just seems like a bit of a contention in his relationships, like how much he spends at the Chen's. And um, she's just gonna be like, uh, she's gonna be like, listen, we're gonna be going to school soon. And uh, we're gonna be, uh, you know, going our separate ways, I feel like, because you're gonna probably go to a different school than me. You haven't even discussed with me where you wanna go. You haven't even told me where you're applying to. And I just feel really left out of the loop. And uh, he's gonna be like, Tara, it's what is your problem? Why are you so upset? Because you don't discuss things with me. And you always go over and talk with Landon and talk with Charlotte. And you don't even talk to me about where you're going and what you want to do with your life. And she's just gonna be like, you don't even discuss with me. I mean, what scholarships have you even applied to? Uh, where have you applied to school? You don't tell me anything. And she's just gonna be like, I just think we should break up because I just don't even know you anymore. All right, and then I think she's gonna, he's gonna be like, I just can't even believe that you're breaking up with me. Oh my gosh. So I feel so bad for Malcolm because he desperately wants, oh, he's stinky too. <laughs> oh no, that's that guy. <laughs> is it, or is that him? What's going on? Why is he so stinky? But his hygiene's fine. Um, oh, that's her hygiene. Okay, yeah, he is stinky. Okay. All right, so they've broken up. He needs to get home, take a shower. He's very upset. I just feel really bad for Malcolm because he really is just trying, and he just really is trying to find the right person for him, and it just seems like these girls are just not right for him. Um... And it's just that they're so jealous of all the time he spends away from them. And oh, she's crying too. Everything's just so horrible. This is just the ultimate place for breakups. I mean, honestly, uh, I feel so bad when the Sims cry after a breakup. <laughs> and I laugh because it's just so uncomfortable. But anyways, <laughs> we're going to head back uh, to the Chen's. And Malcolm's going to just take a quick shower. And um, yeah, we'll see what happens. All right, you guys. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to end this part right here. And in the next um, video, it's going to be season two of the Chens. So we're going to be off to college and um, we'll get to follow them through their college life. So uh, I hope you all enjoyed the video today. Thank you so much for hanging out with me. And I will talk to you all in the next video.